They're called Sasa, Code Red, Nimda, I Love You, or Love Sam, and they lurk in the computer networks of this world. Computer viruses and worms have a multitude of names, and more importantly, a multitude of consequences. Sometimes they're just a nuisance, but often they can be vicious, even resulting in the irretrievable loss of your data. Some people find it hard to believe, but this problem can hit even the best of us, and the damage is immense. Nowadays, malware, that's the generic term for viruses, worms, trojans and the like, is normally created by professional programmers. And they're after just one thing, money. They hack into private data such as bank account login data and passwords for online gaming. Once this data is cracked, they can help themselves to your money or line their pockets with virtual winnings from online games. Checking whether your computer is infected is a piece of cake. Suitable virus scan tools are even available on the web free of charge. In just a few minutes, trial programs can scan your computer to see whether it's been infected and treat or delete infected objects if they're found. Professional protection starts at around 30 euro and should be active at all times. This is the only way to ensure that every action executed on your PC is checked. Though one single good quality program is enough. Total security solutions that provide protection not only from viruses, but also from unwanted hacker attacks and unsolicited spam mails may include additional functions, like online child protection into the bargain, and they're available from around 40 euro. In no time at all and with no great difficulty, malicious objects can infiltrate your computer. It's those who are combating this malware who face the biggest challenges. At Kaspersky Lab's Central Virus Alert Office in Moscow, the entire internet is searched for new threats continually, 24 hours a day in fact. For this, Kaspersky virus analysts use the latest technology and methods to ensure that they stay one step ahead of the hackers. Heutzutage gibt es im Sekundentag neue Viren, das heißt wir brauchen dort überall Sensoren, um solche Programme einzufangen. Solche Sensoren sind zum Beispiel gefälschte E-Mail-Konten, also gefälscht einfach in der Hinsicht, dass dort keine Person dahinter steckt, sondern dass sie einfach angelegt werden mit dem Ziel eben möglichst viele bösartige E-Mails zu bekommen. Das gleiche Instant Messenger, also ICQ, MSN, was es alles gibt, auch dort natürlich Identitäten, die extra angelegt werden, um Viren zu bekommen. Und letztendlich haben wir natürlich auch einfach ein Netzwerk einfach aus Experten und Partnern, die uns immer wieder mit den aktuellsten bösartigen Programmen versorgen. Also sobald was entdeckt wird, bekommen wir das zugeschickt. Once the analysts have detected new malware, they update the virus scanner software accordingly and pass on the updates to the users in the form of automatic update downloads. In the future, the risks are set to become increasingly grave. Kaspersky Lab, however, is armed with the tools needed to deal with any risk that might arise. Actually, there are computers are everywhere, and it's not just the desktops, uh, it's not just file servers or smartphones. Uh, computers and computer systems are in cars, in uh, uh, their, the planes. Uh, so they are coming to your home machines as well and uh, it's possible to buy uh, the microwave oven and fridge which are connected to the local network already so there are, are such devices already. So I think that it's one of the next threats, next problems, security for home machines. Backup copies should always be made of sensitive data but not on your hard disk. Instead, data should be saved on data carriers such as CD-ROMs or DVDs, where it'll be almost as secure as in a safe.